Hey everybody, it is I, Tyroid Forlorn, the artist formerly known as Necroman Machine, and I'm here doing another minifigure review, but this one isn't Halo related. It is the Megablox Terminator Genesis T800. The, technically, well, if you want to get more into Cyberdyne Systems, T800, the Terminator. Very, very nice figure. I got this this morning. Uh, I woke up, my mom woke me up early to let me know that I had a package. I opened this and I was very, very happy with it what I got so before I go looking into detail let's well let's look at his accessory I'm being very careful with the hands because I don't really want to mess them up at all I, I, I don't have any fear of them but uh, of them breaking but I still want to be careful we just I just really like the look of this uh, gun if my camera would focus come on let's focus there we go looks very very nice this is the painted one. Oh, my computer keyboard turned on I thought I turned it off but um, very very nice looking it's got a very nice silver it runs of um, not really Bandai silver I guess but it's also got a slanted hilt and then it's got its ammo clip back here as well as what I assume is dual barrels I'm not super familiar with the um, Terminator movies past two. I didn't really like three and well, I haven't heard great things of three. I really haven't seen it in a long, long time. And then I haven't seen uh, Salivation or if you're a normal person, Salivation. Actually, before I put that back in, let's look at the figure details. Very, very, very movie accurate uh, like figure. You can see it has this very nice black wash all over it. It's got a peg hole in the back. I mean just look at that head. If it will focus. I, I am working on the whole camera thing trying to get one that will focus. And it's like my normal camera my, sorry about that, my camcorder doesn't work all too well. Very very nice head sculpt with very nice red eyes. Like I said, you can just tell that this is a T-800. Um, even down to the feet. They didn't give him the balls at the... Uh, they, they normally have um, balls at their heel. That they don't... Um, but yeah, let's go over articulation. Because um, the weakest part of this figure is its articulation. But that does not take away from the figure at all. As you can tell, it's a very skinny sculpt. Um, just to compare it with a Halo figure, you can see how bulky a Spartan is compared to this. And due to that, they did have to cut some articulation in order to uh, really, not, not really to keep it this kind of skinny and to keep it nice and uh, uh, very nice and solid. Because this thing feels durable. It feels like it can withstand years of um, without getting loose. Just like most of the new, just like all the Mega Bloks. Um, figures. So I mean it's got a ball jointed head, a ball jointed uh, torso, Let me take that off. a ball hinge at the shoulder, a swivel at the elbow, and nothing at the wrist. Like I said it's most likely due to how the sculpt is. I mean if you can see that you can't because of my camera my phone really I mean like it's very um, it's a very skinny sculpt so again I'll bring in my Master Chief to show you you just see the size of that arm um, and then down at the legs we have a ball jointed or yeah ball jointed uh, thigh and hinged knees just once again I, I can't stop how good they talk about how good this figure looks. Now, of course, this is a this is a battle pack, and there were four of these. This character was in the window of the box, so he was given a painted gun. To gun, I'm gonna actually not yet because I have another thing to show you guys as a joke, because I was messing around with these figures. And I'll show you in a second. Here he is with a another uh, the other T800s. Now these look like they were just brought out of the factory. That's 
how I, I kind of consider it. Like this one's been you know been in battle for a while. It's been out in the battlefield, so it's been weathered and whatnot. But this is just straight out of the factory, brand new sort of T800. That's how I how I've kind of processed this. The other three figures in this pack are this with the, a non-painted uh, rifle. So um, this morning, with when I was talking to some of my friends on on YouTube, uh, members of TAP, they I sent them a picture. Uh, I'm going to prepare the figure for this for the end of the review. You probably just heard ball joints being popped, and you'll see why in a few minutes. So while I do that, here is some size comparisons with a Master Chief Spartan. You see, he is Halo sized, and he is skinnier. Now here he is with one of the old Spartans. And you can see he's kind of confused as why there is a what looks like a naked man there. Um, so. There he is. Here he is with an elite care, uh, figure, the new elites, and here he is with the didact. I'm hoping one day to get a figure that towers the didact, but as it seems, we really haven't gotten one. Um, here it is with Cortana. She's sort of the same. Like her articulation is the same reason that this one doesn't have as much articulation, but I think this one does it a lot better and I hope we kind of get a new version of this figure. Even though I don't like Cortana, it'd be nice to have another version of her. Now I'm going to take this character off screen real quick to show you guys this surprise. Um, we call this the Terminator Centipede that I've created out of, <laughs> out of four. Oh goodness, it doesn't stay together well. But it stood, it stayed together long enough for me to take a picture of it, <laughs> and I kind of want to take more and more pictures because I do plan on buying more of the T800 set because I would love to have a bunch of Terminators just facing down against my Spartans, Elites, whatever I decide to put them up against. But yeah, that's that's the thing. So you just pop it off and then pop this back in the weapon back in and uh, that was my review of the Megablox Terminator Genesis T800 the Terminator hope you guys liked the video this video is a little bit longer than I wanted it to be but I was fiddling around with my camera and I'm going to get better with it I promise I hope you guys liked the video if you did let me know why you liked the video if you didn't like the video then please say why you didn't and please no first comments you he, the person who always, who commented first had his comment removed, and he knows exactly who he is. Well, there's two people. One of them knows who they are. The other one hopefully will. Anyway, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.